Hi, I'm Dr. Oakley, and we're out in southwest Yukon working on a lynx that we're about to radio collar. As you can see, it's a sleepy lynx, so I'm helping out with the anesthesia. A lynx is a cat. There are actually a lot of similarities to your own house cat. If you look at some of the claws on this one, you can just see how long the claws are on a lynx. They're incredible. Um, the paws on these guys are amazing and you can see how big they are. They're just huge, almost like snowshoes. And they kind of just float along on the top of the snow here. A little bit bigger paws than your house cat, but definitely has the same amount of toes. Really nice dew claw, incredible nail on it. They like to hook their prey and catch them that way. It's awesome. As you can see, a really nice coat, and some of you may have cats this color, but I can tell you this coat is much thicker. If you look, there's a downy undercoat, there's lots of guard hairs, and the most obvious thing is this cat is a little bit bigger than your typical house cat. <laughs> we just weighed this one, it weighed 10 and a half kilos, which is about 23 pounds. Although I have seen cats that big, they usually weren't this long and tall. <laughs> so another great thing about the lynx is they have these really interesting ear tufts, and ginormous canines, so exactly the same type of teeth as your house cat would have, just kind of enlarged. Beautiful looking good. So you can see I've got oxygen to support them during the anesthesia, and we need to get back to work. So the lynx is just starting to wake up. We're gonna pull up the oxygen, shut the cage. I can see he's starting to twitch his ears a little bit. 